नमस्ते बिटिया हमेशा खुश रहो बिटिया माई सेल्फ जेवियन डॉक्टर आस्था सिकरवाल असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ ऑर्गन ऑफ मेडिसिन फैकल्टी ऑफ होम्योपैथिक साइंस ज्योति विद्यापीठ वोमेंस यूनिवर्सिटी जयपुर टूडेज टॉपिक इज द एग्जामिनेशन ऑफ द पेशेंट फ्रॉम जे टी कैन फिलोसफी the patient details his sufferings the persons who are about him relate what he has complained of how he has behaved himself and all that they have remarked in him the physician sees hears and observes with his other senses whatever there is changed or extraordinary in the patient he writes all this down in the very words which the latter and the persons around him make use of he permits them to continue speaking to the end without interruption except where they wander into useless digressions taking care to exhort them at the commencement to speak slowly that he may be enabled to follow them in taking down whatever he deems necessary one of the most important things in securing the image of a sickness is to preserve in simplicity what the patient tells us in his own way unless he digresses from the important things and talks about things that are foolish and not to the point but as long as he conf confines his information to his own sufferings let him tell it in his own way without interruption and in the record he use his own language only correcting his grammatical errors for the purpose of procuring the record as perfect as possible it is one of the most important things in forming the record of a patient to be able to read it at a subsequent examination without being disturbed by the repeated statements of the patient if you write a record in consecutive sentences you will be so confused when hunting out the symptoms of the patient that you will be unable to form an image of that sickness in the mind it is truly impossible when the mind is full with the effort at hunting out something to listen with proper and concentrated attention you should divide your page in such a manner that when the patient is talking to you about this things and that thing and the other thing of her symptoms you can with one glance of the eye look down over the page of the record and see everything there is in that page if your record is not so arranged it is defective a record can be so arranged by dividing the page into three columns the first of which contains the dates and prescriptions the second the emphatic symptom or headings and the third things predicted of the symptoms after the patient has detailed his sufferings in his own way and you have gone through them and discovered all the things that you can predict of his symptom then you can proceed to make inquiry of someone who has been with his patient in a study like this with most of our private patients there has been a nurse sometimes only a sister or a mother or a wife who has been observing all the sick individual has complained of it is sorry it is more important in this instance to decide whether the observer is over anxious if a wife whether she is not frightened concerning her husband and so intermingles many of her notions and fears which you act, must accept with discretion if such a thing can be done in acute suffering it is worth more than the words or expressions of the nurse the wife for instance because the more interested and anxious the person is the less likely she will be to present a truthful image not that she wants to deceive but she is dreadfully wrought up and the more she thinks of what he has said the greater his sufferings appear to her and she exaggerates them it is important to have the statement from one who is disinterested two or three of the observer who are intelligent having been consulted and their statements recorded the physician then notes his own observations homeopathy also has rules for examining the case that must be followed with executed 
through private practice if you neglect making a careful examination of the patient will be the first sufferer but in the end your yourself will suffer from it and homeopathy also the questions themselves that hanneman gives are not important but they are suggestive and will lead you in a certain direction question the patient then the friends and the observe for yourself if you do not obtain enough to prescribe on go back to particulars after much experience you will be expert in questioning patients so as to bring out the truth store up materia medica so as to use it and it will flow out as your language flows you must put yourself on a level with the form of speech your patients use be sure you have not put any words into your patient's mouth or biased his expression if you want to know all the particulars but without asking about it directly if you ask a direct question you must not put the symptom in the record for 99 times out of 100 the patient will answer by yes or no if the patient's answer is yes or no your question was badly formed a certain the precise part of the body the pain was in and the character of the pain etc in investigation a case there are many things to learn the length of the attack appearance of the discharge if it be a case of vomiting its character the time of day etc leave the patient in freedom always don't put any words into his mind, mouth never allow yourself to hurry a patient get into a fixed habit of examination then it will stay with you it is only when you sustain the sharpest kind of work that you can keep up your reputation and fulfill your highest dues say as little as you can but keep the patient talking and keep him talking close to the line if he will only talk you can find out symptoms in general and particular if he goes off bring him back to the line quietly and without disturbing him there is not much trouble in private practice there you will do a better average of work all sleep symptoms are important they are so closely related to the mind the transfer from sleep to waking from cerebrum to cerebellum is important it is important not only to know the superficial but the real profound character to enable you to recognize one symptom image from another this session powered by digital version 2.0 jyoti vidyapeeth women's university i hope you are satisfied with my digital session if you have any query please mention it in comment box i will resolve it thank you